Okay, everybody, so we're getting down to kind of some of the final stages on this uh, appreciation build for old Tom over at Rambler 69. Um, starting to really do some final assembly on the 32 Ford High Boy. And so what you can see here is that we've got a bunch of the parts laid out and painted and uh, ready to go on. And so um, we're going to get the uh, get the engine mounted uh, onto the chassis get the radiator in um, start uh, getting the body mounted on onto the frame so uh, we're gonna do it like we've been doing it on uh, time lapse and so I'm gonna get this camera switched over and we'll get started y'all stay tuned
Hi everybody. So we did finish the 32 Ford High Boy Street Rod. Um, this is our uh, build for the um, Old Tom Rambler 69 appreciation build uh, that Jeff over at Jeff's Model Garage hosted, or that he started. Um, and anybody who wanted to could jump in and so um, I was glad to do that uh, you know Tom's one of the really uh, kind of core members I think of our community and always willing to help folks and uh, is a great builder so uh, I was glad to to be able to get in on this build and so um, this is the kit that I built and so uh, without wasting too much more of your time uh, I will show you the finished product so hang on just a second okay and so here we go here is the finished uh, kit uh, the finished build um, on the 32 Ford hi boy um, I'm not gonna spend a lot of time talking about too many of the details um, I'm gonna do a slideshow at the end of this video so um, if you wanna you know watch that um, you can see a lot more of the detail but I'll just point out a few things first of all we'll just take it uh, we'll just take it all the way around so you can kind of see uh, did get our Florida old Tom license plate on the back of it um, I did kind of rake back the uh, the windscreen a little further than it really shows on the box I think but I think it looks looks pretty cool Kind of raked back like that that kind of makes it look a little faster um, and I did do I did paint up the the sides for the hood um, but I decided uh, there there's one of them um, I decided to leave it off because I think it looks really cool with the with the engine compartment open on the sides um, where you can kind of see everything um, and so the uh, the paint that I used for the body I was really kind of I was really pleased with the way it came out with this color um, it is actually just um, this is master's touch acrylic um, and this is a pearl pearl acrylic that uh, Hobby Lobby sells uh, with their you know like their tube acrylic paints and stuff I got a set of these and so I decided I wanted to try this pearl pearl green acrylic and um, I really really like the way it turned out so I like the way the color turned out and the way that it you know kind of you know kind of blends in with the interior and all of that or how it kind of matches up with the interior so um, just kind of turn it back around a little bit here and show you uh, let's go ahead and pull the we'll pull the hood off so you can see the like I said, you'll you'll see more details of the uh, of the engine um, and everything in the slideshow. But uh, of course, we did wire it. I uh, made my own little um, ignition coil uh, for the coil wire to go to. Um, did my own uh, radiator hoses, upper and lower. Um, so yeah, just a few little few little. Uh, you know, scratch built things here and there, but uh, otherwise, um, it's pretty much straight out of the box. So, uh, anyway, uh, Tom, I hope you hope you en enjoy it. I hope you uh, you like it. Um, I really enjoyed building it. Um, I, I'm I really like the you know the older the 20, 29 um, through about thirty two thirty three Fords. Um, also, well, I like I like them all. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna put a limit on it, but um, just uh, one other thing. I think I mentioned when I started doing the um, the time lapse uh, videos that uh, in those videos you were gonna kind of see you know some of the things that happened warts and all. So um, if you watch real closely in some of the time lapse videos at the beginning of this this episode. Um, you'll see some warts. Uh, had some kind of pieces that fell apart on me, had some pieces that I struggled with, but uh, you know we got through it and um, and you know we wound up with a fairly decent looking finished build so um, I'm I'm pleased with it Tom I hope you're hope you're pleased with it. 
uh, and uh, just hope you realize how much uh, everybody in this community appreciates you. So uh, anyway, I'll sign off. If y'all want to stay tuned for the slideshow, um, see that, then uh, please do. Uh, we will see you on the next video. You all take care. Have a great rest of your weekend. Talk to you later. Bye.